So we were at the Heinz Memorial Chapel hearing the Heinz Chapel Choir sing one of the performances of their holiday concert series. And we are calling this one this year with an inner light. Hi, I'm Ashley Lewis. I'm a senior. I am a natural sciences major on the preposition assistant track. I'm Paige Lewis. I'm a sophomore in the Applied Developmental Psychology program. And we're sisters. <laughs> <laughs> It's a little bit overwhelming at first, especially being new to Pitt, but having a family like the Heinz Chapel Choir and just being welcomed was probably the best thing that could have happened for me. Yeah, being in the choir this long has really like made me appreciate it and make me realize how much I'm gonna miss it after this. My name's Eliza Meyer. I'm a freshman studying business. I'm Anna Meyer. I'm a senior and I'm studying history and anthropology for archeology. span so this is the Chancellor's concert today, which is really cool because the Chancellor will come and they get to invite special guests from Pitt community and like integral people in the wider Pittsburgh community as well. And we get to sing for them and then we get to meet them. And it's, it's just a really fun thing to get to do. It's so exciting to see how many people come out to see us and like be able to just make their holiday more fun and jolly and hopefully <laughs> make a difference in some ways. Definitely with all the stress of classes and adjusting to college, it's definitely been a great time just being with people who also care about singing and also care about being together. I think the choir is definitely a very memorable part of my, my freshman year. This is my 10th year at Pitt. I followed John Goldsmith, who had been with the choir for 25 years and had created some really wonderful traditions that built on the traditions of our founding conductor, Pop Finney. It's been my great joy to carry those forward, to imagine new things for the choir to do that helps us to forge a path forward with the new kind of student that's coming to us these days.